Active Rotation Podcast, Critical Care Pharmacy Minute, where I discuss one critical care pharmacy thought in about one minute. I'm Pharmacy Joe of PharmacyJoe.com. Is the potential for serotonin syndrome from linazolid plus fentanyl relevant in ICU patients? Linazolid has been implicated as a cause of serotonin syndrome by itself or in combination with other serotonergic agents. Case reports I reviewed of serotonin syndrome from linazolid suggest the interaction usually is mild and resolves quickly. I was unable to locate within PubMed a single case of fatal serotonin syndrome in a patient receiving linazolid. No case reports in PubMed describe serotonin syndrome resulting from linazolid and only fentanyl together. The last thing a critically ill patient needs is a complication from drug therapy such as serotonin syndrome, but there will be patients who need both linazolid and fentanyl for legitimate reasons. If both linazolid and fentanyl are needed and alternative medications are not equally safe and effective, I do not consider the combination a contraindication. The intense monitoring that ICU patients receive with one to two nurse patient ratios allow for rapid detection and treatment of serotonin syndrome should it occur. If the combination is used, I advise the nurse and the physician to monitor for signs of tremor, myoclonus, hyperthermia, rigidity, hyperreflexia, in coordination, confusion, or coma. Let me know what you think of this interaction by leaving a comment at pharmacyjoe.com slash episode 215.